Kingdom, the original Netflix miniseries, became a worldwide must-watch after its release last January. The show, set in Joseon Dynasty, Korea, combines a historical drama with a zombie thriller for a unique mix of mystery, suspense, and interesting costumes. One item in particular caught viewers' eyes. The hat, called a gut. Worn by many characters in the drama, on social media, it's become known as the Kingdom Hat. The gut is a traditional Korean hat worn by high-ranking men of the Joseon Dynasty. It features a tall cylindrical shape with a wide brim and is made from woven horsehair, which allows for its see-through construction. It even comes with a cover to protect the hat from getting wet. Through hat, and its pronunciation, which sounds similar to the English word God, made it all the more intriguing. Many viewers made comments about the hats, saying things like, I don't know what kind of hat it is, but I love it. Or, it's so pretty. And even some who described Kingdom as a drama about zombies and cool hats. The producer of TED, John Jacob, said, Can we talk about all the hats in the show for a hot second? I need a scholar of Korean history to unpack all of these lids. The Kingdom hat can be seen for sale on sites like Amazon, and even Netflix prepared cut as a present for fans anticipating season two of the drama. It's not just fans of Kingdom who seem to be interested in the gut. Two of the stars of Terminator Dark Fate, Natalia Reyes and Mackenzie Davis, who visited Korea last October, said the hats had caught their attention too. Mackenzie Davis, while wearing the hat, said, It looks like something you'd see in a vintage Dior collection. I love it. Because Korea's traditional clothing styles are not yet as well known in the West as, say, Chinese or Japanese traditional clothing, fans seem to be attracted to the interesting array of styles that appear in the drama. And there are a lot, depending on the character's class and identity. Though it's a zombie thriller, Kingdom is still a historical drama, and special effort was made to make sure the costume designs are accurate. With season two of Kingdom having premiered on March 13th, there will no doubt be more interesting costumes for fans to marvel at. Director Park In Jae said at a recent press conference that season one 때 이제 가시 예 그리 될 줄은 사실은 예상이 안 됐던 것처럼 벗어날 수도 있는 거고 뭐. Adding that maybe in season two, the traditional curved Korean socks called poson would take off. Who knows? We might just see a worldwide surge in poson sales sometime soon.